judging by what is happening around the world, mm -hmm. you will notice that um, those who are excelling were identified much earlier than most of us who are not um, excelling in any discipline. Mm -hmm. They were identified earlier, nurtured, and given directions, uh, direction, uh, some kind of direction yeah. to what they would end up being in life. Mm -hmm. Given the, they were also given the benefits of what being step? channeled in that, because yes. there are some things that you, you cannot just channel someone. I just thought, ah, but what What's then am I? Yeah, you, know, you see. So I our cycle needs to be complete. Mm -hmm. It must start from the potential of being identi it's identifying the potential, yes. nurturing it, mm -hmm. uh, exposing it, Rooming and it. and it must have the result end. Yes. So if you are going to be good in this mm -hmm. and complete all the hard work. Yeah. This is what this you are bound to, to end. Yeah. So we, we, I feel we don't have that kind of... Um, awareness? Yeah, that kind of awareness, that kind of uh, institutional um, management to, in order to deal with um, kids that are disadvantaged like that. Because parents can only do so much. Yeah good as my child may be, I may not have the capacity to take them anyway. So, which is very sad. Yeah. Manawaya gets frustrated, Arukumba, and um, they start indulging in drug-related um, and drinking habits. Yeah. Yeah. That's what frustrates our kids, actually. Yeah. And they end up in those... Hey, yeah. Those not frustrate our yeah. Mm. Even in the urban urban setting, it's the same. It's the same because yeah. you're you're learning in a in a ghetto school, right? Mm. But then you don't have that extra exposure. And now I think the recreational, even in the urban urban area uh, urban areas, the recreational areas they're not doing so much. Exactly. Um, and I exactly. think that's where mm. we need to to probably penetrate and 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 get the recreational um, parks, especially. They can now start be more serious with for example a swimming pool you Absolutely. find there is a pool mm. there but there's yeah. no water it's not being managed well so the community is actually not benefiting from that recreational um, setting that's supposed to Absolutely. Benefit. so I don't know how, how best can we <laughs> look can we guys we, we, we must face sad. the honest truth mm -hmm. um, rec recreational facilities were built mm -hmm. But we are now misusing them. We are now building jimojinu that are meant for those recreational yeah. places. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. We are expanding as a population. We are growing. Mm -hmm. Patriku Vaka, are we con taking into consideration that we must have recreational facilities? No. What we are worried about is power, 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 power. And more completely forgetting. <laughs> so what that is yeah. doing is we are suffocating. Yeah. Uh, yes, yeah. we are suffocating. Mm -hmm. experience that recreation yeah. of growth. Yeah. They are being suffocated out. Yeah. Because it's not every house that can build a, a swimming pool because there is Absolutely. not enough space. You see now. That's why those facilities are built. Exactly. For to cater for that uh -huh. area. You know, but uh, I, yeah, I know. it's, yeah, it's, 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 it's a whole yeah. chain that needs to be to be to, to be sorted Revisited out. Yeah, and sorted out. Yeah. Okay, let's move on. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I think we've really <laughs> dwelt on that, uh, and um, I hope um, some people are, are, are hearing what we're saying, and they're going to do something about sure. about it to make a change in yeah. communities. If they don't, we have to. We have step to step in and do it. Yes, we have to step in and do it. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, we can't yeah. be waiting because we can't that. just watch. Mm. We can't mm. just watch. We have Absolutely. to do something mm. out there. Yeah. So, um, um, besides being a musician, everybody knows you as a musician. Um, yes. What else are you are you are you doing? Especially coming out of this. Well, we're still in it, but mm. now it's a bit better. You know, we have vaccinations that have come through, and and you know, worldwide, I think we are now at a at a, 
a bit relaxed uh, situation right now with, with, with the uh, COVID-19 pandemic. Um, what were you doing? How have you managed to sustain yourself? You in uh, being in lockdown, right? Mm -hmm. But you're not being able to really do your music, yes, you know? Absolutely. And you're not really getting the full income that you're supposed to get mm -hmm. from music, especially yes, the fact that you're not you can't go like outdoors you can't do outdoors right you can't yes, go out there yes. and and share your music with people how have you managed to to sustain yourself and your family how are you feeding your family yeah true very mm -hmm. difficult uh, time indeed um, where you find that uh, the use of the garden garden becomes very helpful mm -hmm. and uh, obviously sourcing uh, produce or other re related goods to yes. for to, for resale yes. um it's all the minor things that we did not pay much attention to mm -hmm. that we are now um, exposed to uh, just to to feed the family uh, uh, on a day-to-day -day basis yes. and um prior to me being a, a a performing artist. Mm -hmm. I was in the advertising industry and um, I've now started bringing that back to the fore, um, doing consultancy work here and there uh, to make sure that um, the family is fed as well as yeah, um, j j just bringing in um, or converting old ideas into new ideas, you know, just getting exposed to uh, the new trends in terms of uh, design, advertising and marketing and stuff like that. Yeah. So that's what I'm currently doing uh, with uh, uh, one or two organizations as a consultant. Yeah, just to make sure, you know, I'm not idle. Um, it's a pity uh, the music side is, has suffered in the sense that I, I realized I couldn't give it a hundred percent uh, without anything coming through uh, from it. Um, yes, uh, online sales mm -hmm. were giving me uh, a little bit of income, yeah. uh, but uh, not enough to sustain the family. So now um, I've, I'm spreading my wings wider mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, being involved a lot more in uh, um, other related projects. Is it? Yes. Okay. Interesting. And these are the things that we had actually put on the side, focusing on maybe something that you love the most, which was music. Yes, yes. And now uh, you had to fall back on your other yes, talents yes. or your mm. other, um, you know. You, look, you mm, one always feels indebted to their fans mm -hmm. uh, or their followers. Yeah. And that you always feel you need to do something um, good for them. Yeah. Uh, as well as uh, release that part desire yeah. um, to produce something mm -hmm. um, that excites you and ex may excite everyone yeah. else. But um, yeah, like you said, it's, 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 uh, we just realized that um, that may just not be enough. Mm -hmm. um, and it's important to explore yeah. and uh, venture into other trades that will help the music itself as well support, as a support yeah, as, system, as a support yeah, system. Yeah. because uh, there's no guarantees no. Uh, in in what we do yeah. um, regardless of whether people really love it or they don't mm -hmm. there's no guarantee of whether you're gonna make it or make it big or make it you well, know okay. yeah so yeah okay all right, so um, a bit on the on the, on the like more to one word answer. What's your inspiration or your motivation? People, people, people motivate me. Yeah, I've been motivated by a lot of people. Yes. people that I read about, mm -hmm. people that I talk to, mm -hmm. uh, people that I see mm -hmm. uh, develop in life. Yes. All right. Yes. Oh, that's very fair enough. Um, so you spend a lot of time with different people. Do you interact a lot, or you're more to your family, your music, you 
shut yourself in the room and you know compose songs and that or you you're more on the interactive side right um i'm an introvert mm -hmm. um and at times uh, being an introvert mm -hmm. um you tend to stick more to yourself mm -hmm. especially uh, um, like most people that are artistic but mm -hmm. um, um, lately uh, it's important to create a network yeah. the power, power of networking cannot be equaled by anything yeah. um, what happens in the life of an artist is we have an creative in intuition where half the time you are wanting to keep your ideas and your head is full of so much that you want to put together yeah. and give to people mm -hmm. and that kind of like pulls you away from from, from people yeah from people it pulls you away <laughs> it because does, you're yeah. absorbed in your own little world the where you are yeah. you are wanting you are you are being creative and thinking of this and that and you know, this is why people ask you, how do you come up with this? It's because the, the mind is working all the time. All the time, yeah. Um, so it kind of withdraws you from people. Mm -hmm. The only people you get to interact with are your friends when you're now on stage. Yeah. Which is an interaction that's not... The real thing. Yeah, well, <laughs> it's, it's got a, some kind of a border yeah, line. Yeah, it's got a mass in uh, it. Yeah. So yeah, um, now um, it's recreating, you know, those synergies and uh, mm -hmm. um, you know, I'm meeting as many people as I can mm -hmm. uh, to utilize the contacts that I have, mm -hmm. uh, and for people to understand the pers perspective of an artist, you know, from an artist perspective, and also to understand what people themselves expect from artists so yes um, I'm, I'm giving myself a fair share of that which was um, a positive in this COVID times because uh, yeah. I had a lot more interaction with people mm -hmm. um, and of course the family yes. um, um, spending time with them mm -hmm. and hearing out the ideas yeah. whatever um, I do is literally first commissioned here at yeah, the end of the day, you know. Yeah. So they have to understand uh, what dead does, and I also have to understand what their needs are and yeah. how we come together as a family in order to deliver what needs to be. Yeah. Mm, interesting. Um, okay. Uh, as we wind up, what's your advice to a fellow musician to a fellow business person to a fellow like the people who are actually watching us right now what's your word of advice uh, pertaining to life in general um, but focusing on what we've actually discussed today what, how, how can we inspire the next person yes um, there's passion uh -huh. then there's talent um, you can be talented and not have a passion, a passion. For, <laughs> for your talent. Yeah, for oh your my talent. God. Yeah, and it's vice true. versa. Yeah. You can be passionate and not have the talent. The talent. Mm -hmm. um, what's important is to identify your strength now. Mm -hmm. When you identify your strength, it then helps you uh shape up what you are passionate about but may not have the talent for mm -hmm. or the other way around yeah. um for example i'm not the greatest songwriter um and there are people who are very good at writing songs mm -hmm. i may not be the greatest performer um and there are people who are good at performing yeah. uh, i may be the greatest producer um, and not necessarily for my music True. alone you yeah, know yeah. so when we begin to identify our strengths and build on them 
not as an island, yeah. but by linking with people around you Networking, in order yeah. to then build a team. Yes. Um, that's when you begin to move forward. It's true. Yeah, you need to appreciate so, the yes, person. We, work together. Yeah. Um, yesterday, musicians mm -hmm. were very passionate. Mm -hmm. And fortunately, the ones who were passionate were very talented. Now the world is open. We've got all sorts of people that are coming up with yeah. ideas that yeah. think they are musicians, some <laughs> that are, yeah. but who may not be passionate. So mm -hmm. it, it, the, the world is open. People go to different studios and produce something. Yeah. Um, this is the stage where we must be truthful. And, to uh, ourselves. To ourselves. <laughs> yeah. Or to people that we are grooming or we're working with you yes. know I, we think or we hear your strength inclined to a b c d yeah. for example in mm. the music industry producers i think they have that role yes they, but what's happening really, now it's, mm. a, it's a difficult role to yes actually hold. why money because anyone who wants to record can i marry you come and record and I'll produce you. I'll produce you. <laughs> I'll produce you. Whether you have hey, the talent or not. <laughs> whether you have the talent or not. You yeah. get a few who we'll say, ah, is as discreet, a madly Then those are a different breed. Mm. But the bottom line is um, we need to be truthful yes. at an early stage yeah. so that we bring the necessary people to, you know, to, to, to attach themselves to you in order to. To come up with a yes. good product. Yes. Yeah. No. That's my advice. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> there you have it, viewers. Um, Victor, our celebrity inspiration of today. Um, Yo, it was. This was. This was just powerful. And thank you so much for your wise words. Um, we wish you the best in everything that you're doing. Thank you. And uh, we want to hear some more music from you. Yeah, sure. Uh, I'm sure you kindle those old days. Yes. She was my. <laughs> Vocalist at some. At some in point, fact, yeah. mm, you want to tell let them. Me, let me let me tell you something. Before I, we were friends before I was in music. That's true. Try to discuss idea. You don't. I remember <laughs> you used to come to my idea. house. Hey. In my brain, yes, we name Bira, a radio, can you record? You know, the double press, and this song, my darling, in the Gatu Tanga Guimbra, you will get an idea. I remember the tutorial, I don't know where we were, Tayenda, so you know, in idea, but then it didn't make sense. It didn't. You listen to it, you got okay. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was a end. time when it when it became making a lot a bit of sense. Yeah, yes, you yes, came uh, and you played, and that's when we started the recording. Yes, and yes. You were uh, like, okay, I want you to put the female voice, uh, 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 and we'll do it, and voila, it yeah, then became a song. And oh, wow, well, you recorded. So we come a long way. We come a long way, <laughs> and 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 I really appreciate. Um, the relationship that we have, we have, pretty, we have maintained. Yes, you yes. know, we have maintained mm. to be to, to to still become people who are in the same industry, who are holding each other's hand, sure. hands, mm. and 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 you know, pushing each other yes. to, to 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 achieve exactly Absolutely. the things that we want to achieve in life. And uh, we really appreciate you to be here. Thank, Thank you. you so much Thank for you your very time, much. and uh, God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Cousin Talks.